know sometimes things can be difficult, but I'm here for you. Are you familiar with Schrodinger's cat? Until you decide what happens, everything is happening at once. Like in Detroit. That was stupid. What she just said right there was stupid, and everyone heard that. Did they? Yeah. Oh, I guess they, yeah, because the game audio. All right, continue. No, I understand. Okay. We don't need to talk about it. Just continue. We can get rid of, um... Gonna, oh, jeez. We get rid of the uh, the camera for a second. I'm gonna fix the background. Oh, okay. We forgot. Oh. <gasps> Listen, buddy. Yep. I know you're you're concerned about getting too emotional and getting an annoyed on camera. Listen, my man. I'm here for you. We, we are did, basically look, a support group, all right? Uh, look, if you get it's, upset, it's fine. I want you to let it out. No, I no, it's Cause fine. Cuz A, it's, just a video game. it's healthy. No. B, it's a okay. video game. Oh. This is what you should be getting mad at when you're going to get mad. I see. And C, I don't know if I And C, really agree. It's okay, man. We're all here for you. We're here with you. Laughing at the game. With you. I, 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 caging is, man. <laughs> Time to see if Mufuki's a horrible person. You can skip this. We've seen this. You can? Probably. Oh. All right. End of the line. How'd you be able to skip this, eh? End of the line. Should've yeah, just no, stayed I still. Believe. Played the character. <laughs> You're playing the character. I'm not now. I can't, it's too late to play the character. This is how she was supposed to do it, man. We have to go. This is Kara's story. All right. Well, maybe I'll be a robot from now on. For the character Dude, again. Dude, I cannot wait till that thing happens. You're gonna get so irritated. You're gonna just look at me and be like, I can't believe a grown man wrote this. Well, I'm so excited. Oh my let's gosh. Put the other one. <clears throat> we have nowhere to go. She's exhausted and it's pouring rain. Can we just stay for a little while? This bus is going back to the depot. There's nothing I can do. Just so that choice doesn't matter. Don't play it analytically, man. Like, oh, some choices matter, some choices don't. Just play the game. I am. The way I play a game is to play is to play analytically. You actually have to play a game to not play it the way I want to play it. Alright. Then play it. Then play it. Anal if then play it analytically. You're saying to play the game and not play it, and then you're saying don't play the game like that. No, I'm just saying like you don't have to worry about that kind of stuff. You do though, because that's how you beat the game. You beat the game just by finishing the game. Oh my god! If everyone then why dies, even bother no, 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 no. Making, if everyone to think no, 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 no. choices, because you're just you're RPing. Like if all choices are equally valid, then just like just on, just, just mash the button until you you pick until. Yeah, but it's what you want to see. But it doesn't matter because the game could just trick me, and then just like and not or not tell me all the information I want to see. Like the thing you talked about last time with the. Yeah, the robot. I know. With the robot, you like and the no, pressure. Aridin, you actually have missed nothing. No, we just started. <laughs> we just started, and uh, you missed no part of this conversation, really. Hey, right, what's this over here? I was just making a comment about how Octo's saying, "You know, just play the game," and I'm like, 
when I try to, he's like, well, don't think of it like that. Don't play it like that. So you know how I know this is the future? How? The back of Kara's pants, the heel, it splits heel. for the shoe. I don't think that's a real thing right now. Oh? I mean, it's probably as much stupid. It, I think it might be. But it looks futury. futury. There was a thing. I come into pre-salt, which is nice. <laughs> it's all about the salt, man. What? Wait, I wasn't What's up, Arlewis? Looking at everything. Hello, Arlewis. Watch over Alice, man. Yeah, but there's other things to do. Yeah. Where was it? There was there was things to check. Oh, it doesn't want me to, I can't check them now? Okay. Alice, you're freezing cold. She's freezing I'm okay. cold. I'm not so cold. You look lost. Recognize him? Go. Yeah. He's the same robot model as the, the dude on the roof that went rogue. Oh. The same look. I think, at least. So what's happening in the story at this point? Uh, <laughs> this too? lady robot... We need a place for tonight. Uh, this lady robot uh, went rogue and saved this little girl from her abusive dad. Wait, what? But she broke... Was he not there? But she broke her programming... And um, I made now her. she's on the run, essentially. I made her when I shouldn't have, because I needed to play the character. Uh, and that's one of three characters. The other character is a detective. Uh, his oh. story's been going pretty normal so far. Uh, he, the, Everyone's a robot. Everyone that you play is a robot. Okay. And the third character can... is Jackson from Grey's Anatomy. I'm not joking. That is the actor. Uh, and he's going rogue as well. But he got shot. Meth got him shot. Aim got him shot. Same with uh, same with Connor, the detective. He got him shot too. But Connor just comes house. back because there's a lot of Connor bots. At least we'd be out of the rain. I thought about playing this game, but Connor, watching you guys plays it makes uh, place. makes me beyond happy that I didn't. Dude, I'm happy. I'm really happy. I went through this game. I. So there's three options. I had. So much fun playing oh, this game with Tristan because he was Did just like, he was like it's so interesting to see your like your mentality when it comes to this kind of stuff and I'm like it's, okay. right like n there was not a single hard immoral choice for me in this game right, I see we need a place to stay do you know anywhere we could spend the night. Oh, he's recharging. Right. That's bound to happen. Android temporary parking. Uh, anything down here? No. This is my max walking speed, just so everyone's aware. So, uh, um, also, Fiddle, because you weren't here for the first right one, there. if you have that triangle on your back, or if it says Android on your back, or if you have a... <laughs> it means <they're> Android, yes, <laughs> Or if you have you. The, uh, the armband on, or there's, like, a, a circle on your temple that's blue, that means you're an Android. None of those mean, like, you can you can take okay, those so off. They're not a part of the Android. Laundromat. But it's just, like, people wear them, so you Sounds like not. a bad idea. Like, that's something that if should, they should be, like, they, Honestly, they should be a part of the Android. They really should be part of the Android. L1. Okay. Mega washer. It's warm in here. You'll feel better ah. in no time. I, I, is there, are, are there wire cutters in here? These are clothes. Okay, well, there's a person here. I guess I should talk to him. I sleeps. He's sleeping. I can't wake him up. I don't know. An option. All also, right. if you weren't here for the first episode of this game, prepare for some serious meth salt. Are you gonna steal this guy's clothes? I'm supposed Alice? to, right? You don't. Ha I didn't. Well, he's asleep. Sure. I can't wake him up for some reason. There's other options. There's three options, right? The game provided. Like, you why wouldn't options. the most obvious option be available to me? Just because to wake you, him up. Because. 
There's the game's giving you multiple. Okay, You're kind of on the run, whatever. dude. Come on, let's go. See, Tristan stole clothes clothes for her. I didn't steal because I'm like I'm a robot. I can't break the law. Right. If I can't steal. I'll, I'll figure something else out. Okay. Uh, wire cutters. Literally came here for the meth salt. <laughs> oh, Honestly, geez. that's why I came to. <laughs> Station's too far. There's nothing more this way. Nothing more. The city literally ends. ends right here. <laughs> a motel sounds like a place to spend the night. A motel. Looks like we found a place to stay. Need money. Is forty dollars. Then there's no point in going inside then. Okay. Okay, I guess maybe there is. Let's go inside. Maybe well, no, no, it's just, you're not allowed to walk into the motel. This is how it works in real life. You can't walk into the parking lot of the motel if you're not a customer. The guy will, will come and be like, what are you doing? We're not going in? We have to find food. I see that we're all here for the same reason then. <laughs> go <somewhere> <laughs> we're here for you, buddy. Mm -hmm. We're here for you. Okay, so get forty dollars for fine clothes. Okay. So if if we need to, we know where clothes are. Yeah. Right. Potentially that guy has forty bucks on him, so we can potentially I don't know rob him. Uh, there's a twenty-four hour like quickie mart. Okay. Well, I'm I'm just going where all the yellow triangle yellow, yellow squares yep. are. Yep. That is uh. That's pretty much. If you want to see everything there. in the game, that's pretty much what you do. Except for time dairy. Right. But usually the time stuff is very clear that it's time. Okay. Sleep in the abandoned, the abandoned car. car. Oh, I can just enter? Okay, well, let's check the store first. A little faster. And you are kind of in a hurry. Yeah, but it's because you're with the kid. Look, like Connor can run open. sometimes. Maybe we should go Look at inside. that contextual handhold. <laughs> That's, that's it took good. 30 years for David Cage to develop that technology. Finally. Yeah, what am I doing perusing here? You can talk to him. Yeah, there you go. There's... Remember R2, just tapping it changes the camera angle. Mm. What do you want? What, what kind of interaction is that to your customer? What do you want? Well, he, you're a customer. robot. You're a robot. And yeah, but go. this happens all the time. We just already saw that. We well, we've already people. seen that some people are just like robots are stupid. Who cares? A homeless android? Ah, that's the best yet. Look, this is a convenience store, not the Salvation Army, okay? You better go if you're not going to buy anything. Okay. Hi. Okay. Same thing I did. I'm not gonna steal from the dude. We'll go in here. I mean, I think I, if I remember here. correctly, Tristan stole the clothes. Right. Uh, the reason, by the way, I, I'm saying everything that Tristan did is because Tristan had me play this game in front of him over the course of a few days sure when Mac my is there. when my uh, wife was on vacation. So he really wanted to see how I played through the game. So I was asking him consistently how he played through it. He played through half, and his brother played through half, and they played vastly different. So, that's why I'm just, so, to see where Mef stands, what Mef does, right? So, if he does something, I can kind of fill in if I did another thing, what would have happened? Mm. Um, Tristan stole the clothes and then stole the money from the cash <laughs> register <laughs> and then spent the night in the hotel. I see. Break. Oh, let's abandon them. Ouch, ouch. Stand back, Alice. Oh, yep, open it up. It was unlocked already. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even try. I just assumed. Sleep in car? Can can't sleep, sleep in, in car. The car now. My other options are the hotel, which like, we can't afford, here. and I don't want to sleep in there. the wire cutters. Can find a better place? Uh. Okay. We'll find somewhere better.
All right, so now we're in here, though, so let's... Um... Yeah. Probably have more options in here. Oh, there you go. That's a wire cutter. That's what I find the wire cutter's for. Well, probably don't sell them at the convenience store. Well, I mean, I, I figured there'd be a hardware store somewhere along the, the stretch here. Or in this place with you. Mayhaps right there. Wires? It's a wire cutter. Is it a wire cutter? Yep, it's a little, it's a little one. It's not like the big ones, but you know. Good enough to get through a chain link. Yeah, that's pretty good. Especially when you're cyborg with crazy robot strength. And now you're like a cyborg mom. They're like mom strength <laughs> when, they can, mom. when they can pick up the cars when they're on their babies. Imagine a cyborg strength, cyborg mom <laughs> strength. Pick up the planet. Yeah, Dude, just, you know oh what place gosh, I always I, wanted to go yeah, hold when it. I was a kid? Where, where? Pizza Planet from Toy Story. Yeah, that would be pretty cool, right? Rad. Are you all right? Oh. Uh-oh. Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. Scratch up your coat, man. No, my biogel or whatever it is. <laughs> Blue blood. Yes. Don't worry, we're just having Ethereum a Ethereum or something. I can't remember. Yeah, something like that. And squat house. Looks abandoned. It's Detroit. So basically all the houses? Yeah. Okay. I'm just going by what I heard. Partially a scene. There are different. Yeah, there you go. Okay, it doesn't work. Okay, yeah, it's locked. Alice? Oh, yo, where's the kid? Alice! Obviously not that way, idiot. I wasn't done. The world the... ends that way. <laughs> I wasn't done checking the perimeter. Alice. Do a perimeter check and then uh, and see what you know. Whoa. See our, uh, Wait, what robot. are you doing? Visitors. Ralph doesn't like visitors. They're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. I don't know what the humans did to you, but she had nothing to do with it. All humans want to hurt us. But Ralph won't let them hurt him again. No, he won't let them. We thought nobody was here. All we want is a place to spend the night. Visitors are dangerous. Look. What they did to Ralph. What they did to Ralph? Hmm. I have... No compassion for this robot. <laughs> uh, you have nothing to worry about. We're not going to do you any harm. You have my word. You must excuse Ralph. Ralph still finds it difficult to control himself. He's Sometimes a robot. His fear makes him do things he regrets. Ralph has seen some hard times. He's just so scared the humans will get him again. You can stay if you want. Ralph won't hurt you. <laughs> I don't know. Sure, okay. stay. Okay, I did not stay. We'll just so let's see how it goes. <laughs> come on. <laughs> oh, your options are shaking. That's how come, you know they're stressful. Come, come yeah, on. that's right. So I, I slept in the car. Ralph has lived here since he ran away. I'm sure that option involves you getting mauled by a dog or something like that. So nope, let's see you sleep in the car just let's fine. see what happens this time. You sleep in the car just fine. I basically saw this guy and it's like, I, I, I hate he's how, unstable. I hate how, how jaded I have to be whenever I play these kinds of games. You can make yourself at home here. I'm sure the Joker robot is trustworthy. Yeah, yeah. Ralph is going to go into the other room. He would like to stay with you. 
But he has things to do. People to kill. It's just for one it's more night. like Two Face, you know? We'll find a Joker. Is that, that's be, is that better or worse? Right. Well. <laughs> so you can sleep. Sit down and I'll start a fire. Okay, I'll access my starting fire protocol. Gurk with laser eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Make bed for Alice. Start fire. Uh oh, the fire. The house is on fire. Is this what you meant? I said I start a fire. Did I misunderstand? Is this what you wanted, God? This fire <clears throat> in this house. Out of the machine. Out of machine. Out of this world, dude. That arcade cabinet. How much do you think that? How much do you want to bet that arcade fire. cabinet totally works? You plugged it in. What here? I don't know if these would work. Bed in your fireplace. Go. I love how you can fail at picking up matches. <laughs> Apparently so. Apparently so. Set up the bed, man. There you go, I two to, pillows. I have to do each action. That's all you need as a human, right? <laughs> I, I, wow, look at that bed, dude. Yeah, I set the bed. I made the bed, you know? It's like if in D&D, &D, the DM made you roll for everything. Right? Like, I'm like, set the bed. Dude, go, RA9. Go, go find... Oh, the, yeah, sweet. Let's, 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 let's get some David Cage nonsense going on here. RA9. What does that mean? What? Those symbols. Why are you writing that? I don't know. I don't know. Ah, uh, yes. Sane wall writing. No problems here. <laughs> I don't regret Some, this decision of letting a little girl sleep here. Also, there's a deer in the fridge. Like, deer. What's up, dude? Hello. I'm also What's spawned up, here. The hu look what the humans did to me. It's just a head. <laughs> look what they did. <laughs> to me. I made me a trophy, dude. And then they made me an android deer. I'm the center of attention. Um, look what they did to James. It's the talking fish. She's like, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> talking bass. Oh, it's fine, because... Is it, have you ever been so inspired that you you had no paper around? You, you just, just cut had a knife. You just cut it. And walls. There you go. I know. I am. Gonna... I have an idea. I have a knife here. There's a wall right there. I have no paper and no pen. What, what's, what's here? Up? We go. All right. Um. I want to walk five feet. Okay, give me a dexterity check. Uh, I got a one. You trip and die. <laughs> <laughs> no. I. Uh, <laughs> Aridin, that's a little game Aridin. called Kingdom Death. Yeah, yeah, that's Kingdom Death for you. Yeah, we made it back into the camp. Oh, oh, tremors open up the Tremors, world. Oh, you die. Oh, you die. There's a fissure that opens up the crack, crack in the world, and then you just die. Yeah, man, you can't contain that artistic vision. That face win. There's nothing in there, as far as I can tell. Like the wood. Hmm, if only there was some sort of bed here. If only there wasn't, uh... I mean, like, it's rot rotted and gross. Pretty gross looking. But like, there's a blanket here. We should take that. Yeah, I mean, like, you could put the blankets mattress. over the rotted mattresses. A... It's better than the floor. It has to be, right? That is clearly a, a stack, a pile of wood. What the heck? Why can't, why can't I take that? Uh, it's not firewood. Okay. Get the propane tank. It just collect wood. Oh. Trevor told me about it. I want to play on Wednesday. Yeah, man. Yeah, 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 it's dude. actually pretty, pretty fun. Uh, it was hard though. It was really hard. There's more wood here. Can't pick that up. Just kind of. This is a very strangely designed house. A lot bigger on the outside. What did I miss here? Where's the wood? Oh, it's in the fireplace. Oh. Oh no, here you oh, go. Oh, sorry. This one plank of wood. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> there was piles of it upstairs. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> drop fire. Drop the single plank of wood into the fire. You duplicated it. 
I, I did. You did? Did you do like roll and then you use the item and then you quickly while you're rolling? Yeah, like, roll, you get yeah, I, I duped it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Duke glitch. Happens in Dave's Gage Cage games too. Remember, that's the the Ugh. touchpad. Yeah. Had to be different. Well, what would you prefer, this or Simon Says? This. Yeah, me too. You can come to bed. I did what I could. It's not much, but at least you'll be warm. What about you? I am a robo. I don't need to you sleep. Didn't, you didn't understand that. Good posture, honestly. Go talk to the dude again, Ralph. Why didn't he ever love me? Why was he always so upset? I'm a robot. I don't understand humans. <laughs> oh, honey, I can. Sympathy not found. <laughs> Empathy protocol not found. <laughs> That's why he was always so angry. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? I don't know, Alice. He'll never leave you, right? I promise he'll never. Uh, I can't. Pro I can never promise that. Alice, we don't know what's going to happen. Will we be together in heaven? I have to lie. But the the butterfly effect of that of Alice is like less with you now. That happens. Cool. Why why am I even here? No no no. It's why because now it's been... now it's Kara learning to, how to lie. Is basically what that is. But why why even give him the choice then? Because it's option. thematically appropriate. It's, it's dumb, though. It's not thematically appropriate. It doesn't make me feel like I'm actually doing anything. Just play out of the same play almost out. Almost like, like it's programmed? Almost like, almost like it doesn't matter that what I choose. No, program like a robot? Whoa! You got me. You've got to sleep. I don't, you see. What if I don't want to do that? You gotta. Scripted events, man. Okay. No, you get the illusion of choice in these games. You do. Sleep tight, Alice. There's like, you lock into one road. Like, there's all these choices, and then you. Then you lock yourself into the road, I, and then you like, just have to do it. I shouldn't. Like, I'm, I'm soaking wet, and I can't change clothes. I'm a robot. So I shouldn't actually lie with her, but. For the feels, which am I supposed to say, yeah, lie with her? Whatever. I'm overthinking all of this. Yes, I agree. You're right, you're right, you're right. Maybe I should just like just like push the buttons. No no no, you act on instinct in the moment. What does David Cage want you to say? I, I don't know, that's the frustrating thing. I'm, I'm not a mind reader. But he wants me to, to say to say uh, robots robots are people too. That's what he wants me to say. That's true. He doesn't want you to say that. He at least wants you to ask that. Why how why does that up your relationship with her? She's asleep. Is or is she? She's never asleep. <laughs> that's, the, that's, the, that's the twist. She opens up one eye and the one eye goes bink with or, the red. Or a nine. <laughs> there we she's... go. You wake up and she's made like a pentagram on the ground like, I'm just trying to summon Cthulhu. <laughs> You're my new mother now. You should know about the cult. Here you go. What the heck, dude? There's a yeah. bullet. Out of the back of that dude's face. Oh, there is. What trick? What, what trick are you saying? Um. Yes, I love this game because I get to see uh, Meth go pure Sith Lord, letting the hate flow through him. Look, you're I, Marcus again. Oh, I'm Marcus. But you got shot. Ah, I lived. What is that? Oh, this game is a bag of memes. <laughs> it does seem that way. Diagnose. Why do I have to sometimes press it so I hold it? All right, whatever. That doesn't matter. Just... Diagnose problems. A dude shot me. I was shot in the face. All systems in low power mode defective. And missing leg components. All right, because this is a robot, so he has, he has to. Yeah, he's components. a robot. No, it's just because it's components, not just like missing legs or arms. Paired vision. Corrupted Mind Palace. Mind Palace, really? Okay. 
much audio data. Hey, let's get some legs. One R one. I I I, see, I figured it was that. That's what it would be. Okay, that so compatible. so here's the thing. Good. Quite obviously, they're they're trying to be like, look. Okay. It's like in, it's so crazy. It's so like, inhuman. Because he's like a human, and he's putting like human parts on him. Yeah, that's what it's they're like trying. Horrific. That's what they're trying to go for. Like, look how disturbing this is. You're going through a graveyard, ripping parts off of bodies. And like, but he's a people. He's, he's a people now. Like, when I not, when I saw this, he's a robot. When I saw this with with uh, when I was with Tristan, I just started laughing. He was like, "What's so funny?" And I'm like. I'm basically walking trying. through a junkyard of iPhones, and I'm finding the pieces that fit. Yeah, like it's this is not but disturbing. It, but the, like the way, like the way it's the, disturbing the audio, because it yeah, where the audio is like playing and it's like it's meant to be like horrific. Yeah, it's supposed to but be it's like, like the, the absolutely not because it's a freaking robot. Yeah, like this is this is where I'm like the only reason it looks horrific is because they look like a human. Uh, yeah, but right, like, that's the only reason it's horrific. That's no good. Let's get rid of that one. Yeah, you're, yeah, you need one more leg. Yeah, we need, we need, we need one. We can get by with one. We need, we need the two, though. Pardon me. Uh, how about this? this one looks pretty good. No. Yeah, yeah it's compatible. compatible. Perfect. It's dirty, so I mean, like. Uh, we, we, we can clean it up. This up. Like this technology is really good if you can put a dirty. Right port into another port and it works. Nintendo, man. Yeah. <laughs> we get leave, it, leave it to Nintendo to develop the first Androids. <laughs> it's like, I'm Rob 2.0. It's cool that. I've Spin, been... play with tops with me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think it's cool that we have like a weird like robo heart. Kind of yeah. Looking. I don't know why it has to be. Like, why do they make the, or make the organs look as yeah, realistic Yeah, the inside possible? shouldn't be. Yeah. Just all be like motherboards. So, yeah. Well, one motherboard. Oh really, my gosh! Unless you're really progressive. Oh, spooky human right there! His mouth and stuff! Oh. That's really what they're going for. That's it's, totally what they're going for. And I'm like, it's not... It's only disturbing because it's they look like humans, but it's not actually disturbing when you think about it. This is what you would do! They're trash! Right? Find Jericho! Find Jericho! That dude looks like Kano. It's true. You know. Find Jericho with a name like that. I'm sure it's going to be really safe and fortified forever. So you you were laughing because of just how like over the top this yeah. was. Yeah. I see. Justin was like, "What? How? What do you mean?" And I'm like, "Look, they're all so obviously trying to be like the the what's it called? Like the vi the usual vision you see of hell when the arms yeah, are reaching like Dante's for Inferno you and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like, come why on. Why would all the robot robots be on still? Why would, I know. Why right? wouldn't you de decommission them? So like like this isn't like I'm thinking more about how, how little sense it makes for it to be like this. Like why are there so much I many active robots here? But again, that's me and my analytical mind. And I'm thinking about well, no, I thought about this too, and I was like, do they really not? Do they really just throw androids in the trash and not you know like, do it like cars and crush them and melt them down? Yeah, melt them down. Like there's lots of there's a lot of wasted parts here. Yeah. Like okay, right here, this this this, this robot right here, his arms work. Yeah. Get him, take him off. Yeah. Off of him. What are you doing? You're just wasting parts. You decommission cars, you take, take, take the useful parts off of the cars, you know? You melt down the cars. Hey. Right? Yeah, but you're the only one that Makes can be you're the only one that can rebuild himself because you're so advanced. Oh my goodness. It doesn't matter though, it's still a lot of wasted Oh So much wasted parts. It looks vaguely like you, except it's not you. Like we got, we got, we got two arm, good arm parts here. Uh, I don't know, like could possibly be a good, good like, brain there, or uh, or like torso. Like you're, like you as Marcus are incapable of feeling fear, because you'd be freaking out right now. Mm -hmm. 
So like for him, it's only horrific for us. Hey, I, I'm I, yeah, I'm playing the character right now. You know what I mean? Like it's not horrific for him. Yeah. He's just walking. Well, through, this like, dude whatever. was like walking. Like they got a whole an entire uh, chassis there. You could you could strip for parts. There you go. I was right. It's Ethereum. Ethereum, yeah. <laughs> There you go. There you go. Thank you. Thanks. Why does it make? Why have to make the wires look like vein? I know. Excuse me. Anyway. Not brain. Mind palace. Sorry. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should have said that. I should have got that. Nice, nice, Aridan. All right. There you go. I mean, these parts can't be cheap, right? Like the thermal regulator. You'd imagine. Like that's not. I don't understand. It's not sad. <laughs> it's 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 an iPhone. It is. It is off my old iPhone stuff. broke, and I yeah. bought a new one. I took, took, I, took, I took the SIM card out of it and put yeah. it in another another one. Yeah. You know what I mean? I didn't find a lot of moral quandary. The, like the only thing I was like, man, we should really dispose of these in a more efficient way. Yeah, <laughs> like, that's really how I thought about it. And like, like a lot of pollution happening here. Like seriously, uh, if he had a goatee, he would be Kano. It's true. It's true. He would be Kano. If he was Australian and had a goatee. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Action. Compatible. Optical unit. Blue iris. Those. See, now you're gonna look. You're gonna have Hello. heterochromia because you have green eyes. Oh yeah, so I do. Like this one. This one is even What's reacting that? like a robot. Hello. This is what I was talking about. I'm cool with the robots, the, uh, the early robots from iRobot. That's fine. Yeah. Like crash test dummies. They're there to help you. Yeah. It's when they start looking like Jackson from from Grey's Anatomy. I'm oh yeah, the plate yeah. is Kano. Yeah, I can see it. I see it now. Yeah. <laughs> Dracomia, nice. Good look. Uh, audio, audio processor. processor. Uh, let's see here. Hmm. I think I missed one over here. It's a head, so you have a good yeah. chance. Yeah, good chance to find a ear, maybe. Yep. Nice. Um. By the way, this is why you'd never want to get in a war with androids. <laughs> yeah, I guess they just rebuild themselves. Also, who would want to live near this Dawn of the Dead garbage pile? Yeah, yeah. It's really <laughs> true. Dawn of the Dead garbage pile. Yeah, it's, just, it's really, it's, yeah, this whole sequence is really silly. This melt come um, down. It makes no sense that they would no be sense. like this. Yeah, but. All right. So much so that it makes me think, like, the robots came here. Like, they did this like, They did this themselves, yeah. Get it. All right. To crawl out of the grave. Get it. Feels bad. Birthday man. Sorry, I was typing this, but an entire pig was my hand. <laughs> also, the different kinds of button presses really makes for stilted gameplay because, like, yeah, because he doesn't visually, because he's like, because yeah. oh, the buttons keep changing. Almost like he looks. Oh, that's not that's not intentional. Because, like, <laughs> Beyond Two Souls was like that. Beyond Two Souls was like that. So it was. Uh, that's why David Cage is like, listen, I gotta start making games about robots. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. It's the only though. time this is natural. This triumphant, triumphant music. It's like the end of um, that movie, Shawshank Redemption. It's a great movie. I either have not seen it or I haven't seen it in a very long it's time. It's very good. It won awards, but it is came very out, good. So. Like when awards is meant a little more than they do now. It is like <laughs> it is. I am. I would say that that movie is like as close to a masterpiece mm. for a drama that I like. There's not many movies that are just purely dramas that are better for what they're trying to say. Mm. I think. 
Spielberg movie. No, it's not a Spielberg movie. No, it's, it's Stephen um, King. Yeah. Which honestly, it, it surprises me because like he can write really good stuff, and then other times he he'll, he'll write like the haunted lamp stuff. Yeah. Also, wouldn't people be patrolling uh, this to stop theft and robots crawling away? Dude, yeah. I didn't even think of that. I mean, yeah, choke air. You, you got it. Why? Why? Why the heck not? There you go. Yeah, get, get yeah this your, should uh, be this should be ir 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 irremovable. It should cause it like system failure. Remove that. Oh, good. You can just light up, I guess. Why would you make robots to to, to look like exactly so that, like, exactly like a human? Stop poking holes in this airtight story. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's it's Detroit too. Like, why wouldn't there be people like can't like looking around for parts? My name is Marcus. Dun 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 dun. Oh look! Dun dun. What My rebellion that? leader jacket. Oh good. I... <laughs> what was that there? On the shovel. <laughs> <laughs> they would be like, that one's trying to leave. Just shoot it. Oh no. See, as you can see, I killed it too. I was like, I want to live. Sorry, sorry, honey. You're not alive. You're not alive. Give me that power source now, please. Yeah. It makes the die kill, kill for pump. Yep. Back to the good one. Yeah, Connor boy. I liked, I liked not him. only A, the most handsome, but B, the most fun. So, so which guy is like the crazy enemy guy? Is it, is the it other guy. Yeah, Marcus is. It, I'll show you. This is nice. Too bad I'm a robot and I can't appreciate aesthetics. Pardon me, everyone. I'm on a mission. Oh yeah, it's Jackson. Yeah, that's from him. Anatomy. It's that. It is him. I can't appreciate your your aesthetic. Get out of here. Excuse me. All of the all of the like the main three robots are are were uh, models. Models, yeah. Or actors. Well, I, should, I, should, say, well, not, not I should look around just actors. for clues and stuff. I didn't look around any at any time ever when I was here. It was all like right. talk to Amanda. Got it. Because when I was playing Connor, I'm like, yeah, I'm doing it. Like that's, <clears throat> I'm going for it. Mm. Hello, Amanda. What? Why? Connor. Talking about is that say. Octo? No, no, he's talking about uh, the. Why was the jacket there? Oh, <laughs> no. Finding that deviant was far from Wait. easy. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Thank you, Amanda. We like his the voice. DPD to transfer I like it too. He has like an accent or something. You may teach us Own. something about what happened. The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the deviant? I don't think. Um. It simulated human emotion, fear in particular, in a very convincing way. It seemed completely overwhelmed by them and behaved irrationally. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? I like Hank. <clears throat> um. I think he's irritable and socially challenged. What? But I also think he used to be a good detective. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Um. I will try to establish a but friendly I said too. relationship. Oh, if I can get like him that. to trust me, it will be helpful for the investigation. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype <clears throat> Cyberlife has there ever There you go, created. now you know what Connor is. If yeah. anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me. I literally just want, just have David Cage stop writing these weird stories and just Connor. make a detective game Makes where you're Connor. Them. Because like, so like, so like the, ro robot all, LA Noir. Like seriously, all the parts with Connor are like eight out of ten. 
every part with Connor. Eight, eight or nine out of ten. I love every single scene with Connor. Even leaving late game where it gets starts to get weird. Yeah. All right. The free Lieutenant Anderson. Can I help you? Yes, I'm your armband didn't Anderson. load in properly, so it's a low resolution. Yes. What if they just smiled and one of the teeth? Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet. But <laughs> That's what Bluetooth? Test. Yeah. <laughs> That's how they're connecting, man. <laughs> so stupid. You might be in shock. Tensions in the Arctic have reached a new level. The Russian carrier and American patrol reported to have flagged last night. Several warnings. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay, so a lot of this is just pointless. It's just talking to cops, being like, where's Hank? But you can do whatever you want. But when, when if you don't care about any of this, you just want me to tell you where Hank's desk is, you can just ask me. All right, well, let's... What's hey, the, look, it's that guy. Hey, hey, where do you think you're going, buddy? Hey, Probably hey. reporting that Kara kidnapped his daughter. Hey, I know I know you. I have I have outside knowledge. Hey. Actually, I'm a robot. What do I care? You're not just a robot. You're an advanced robot. Oh, no. Can't, <laughs> can't believe it. Um... <clears throat> Yeah. Uh, What's your other objective? Find the lieutenant. Is it? Isn't it? Find his desk. Oh. Wow, meta gamer, am I right? <laughs> Uh, you're using out of character knowledge. Uh, <laughs> if you could just stop doing that and stop wrecking my campaign, that'd you, be great. You say that with a nerdy voice, but you say that like you're. No, I do not. You, I would hint at it. You would until hint you at it because you subconsciously got my <laughs> my hints that you should I stop. Be, that. I would be passive aggressive about it you know until what time you. Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives. Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. What if I want to sit in his chair? Well, I'll be like, Anderson! Seeing you. <laughs> Explore the new office space. Really get a feel for it. The game literally... That sequence was a... Sit down. Yeah. Stand up. Yeah. Two separate button presses to do that. Yeah. So we're so you're aware. Yeah. Okay. What's Hank like listening to? Uh, apparently, he, like, he like, likes listening to really really retro headphones and uh, devices. It's of the Black Death, 2021. Dark heavy metal. Look forward to that, I guess. I could go for some dark heavy metal. Uh, I'm not a huge fan. I prefer symphonic metal. Yeah, well, it's better than listening to pop. Well, yeah, but... Prog rock? Yeah. Yeah, with some prog rock. Yes, yes. We all know you like probably the most hated <laughs> That's not genre true. of music of That's all time. True. Do you mind that I'm doing this? No, you do not. Fun. Uh, I would hate if my office walls were made of glass. Me too. All. Call Hank Anderson. Hi, this is Hank. Not here at the moment. You can leave a message if that's what turns you on, but don't expect me to call back. Beep. Whatever. Lieutenant Anderson, this is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's almost noon, and I'm waiting for you at the office. Well, that probably had no bearing on anything. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office!
What do you want me to do? Examine his desk? Or a police station? Can't do those things, those things right now. Whatever. So progressing the go. case is your main thing. Exploring the office is, is your supplementary thing. It's auxiliary. Oh yeah, I'm gonna miss this if I explore the office though, so. <clears throat> I've got 10 new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android mage and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. But I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Oh, the guy I partnered with the android hates the androids? Cliche. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm very pleased to have joined the team. I can assure you I'll do my very Close best. Close the door on your way out. I just left. <laughs> I was like, I don't think he wants to talk to me. <laughs> He's right. just like... Have a yeah, nice you day. have a nice day. Bye. <laughs> so I'm not sure if you missed that. So if you if you don't go in there, I'm not actually sure. But I just didn't want to risk it. It seems like something that you could miss, though. Yeah. Uh. Can't explore the. Yeah. Thing the rest of the stuff is just like you can like look on Hank's desk and like you can see like he's a sports fan. And Right. He eats lots of donuts. Uh, and that's what the locked thing is, is talking about his interests. Mm. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Um. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Is there a desk anywhere? <laughs> That's not what I thought you were going to say. No in that one. <laughs> Come on. I thought you were going to ask about his desk, not about my desk. I don't care what's about my desk right now. All right, whatever. These are nice chairs. These are these are really nice chairs. Yes, they're very, fo very futuristic chairs. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. I would more be like, you know, like when you, when you turn on the game and you're like, that was weird. She knew what day it was. I That's mean, my reaction to that. Would that be like, how do you know what yeah. music I like? Too long. Oh, it's like, it's like, a, it's like my, I was just talking about, uh, before she sorry, on my phone. Knows... No, it was uh, like, like where I am and stuff, and like, and like what's like my face. I'd like to yeah. Look at them. Terminals on your desk. Knock yourself out. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop busting my balls, okay?
do. Here we go. All right, so case number seven nine two two four eight zero. Buckle in. Uh, <laughs> look, I don't know why the game wants me to remember or not remember. So let's just scan all files. There you go. Two hundred and forty-three files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX four hundred is reported to have assaulted a man last night. That's Carl. That could be a good starting point mm. for our investigation. Car's model? Mm -hmm. Or yeah. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move past them. And hey, I didn't know don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? Dying the mission, what? I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and either. set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Lieutenant, uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that attacked the guy last night. It's been seen in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. There was no option to like, just like say, you're right. Let me, let me just uh, give you some time. No, I was like, give up. Yeah, I don't know what, I, I didn't <laughs> like, get to that point because I was aggressive with him. Uh, okay, well, whatever. I ba I, basically, when you're whatever. aggressive, you just go, stop pussyfooting around. Right. Let's get to work. And right, right. he does the same thing. He slams you on the table. He's like, hey, what are you doing? I'm like, listen, let's go to work. Is that the same thing happen to you too? Uh, if it wasn't, it's not exactly the same. It's similar. I see. I was just more because I was like, "All right, I'm gonna be nice to him," and then he was like really dismissive. So I was like, "Fine, I'll be mean." That's obviously what he wants. And I have to get a reaction out of him to get him to work. That's obviously right. what's going on. Right, right. Just wake up and the dude's behind you, like, "Hi." Like right next to hi. Ralph's I'm, been writing all night. I wrote on your back. Pretty trendy. RA nine, right? Check. Oh, this is revive fire. This is revive Alice. It's like, oh my <laughs> gosh! What the heck? What choices did you did you make? Well, let me take my, my another single piece of wood. Oh no, there we go. <laughs> Come on, game. You never, you never let me have any fun. I wanted to, her to read the thing while having the wood in her hand. Never mind. I have to put the wood down first. One thing at a time. One thing at a time. Android Zoo. U.S. life expectancy down to 91. 91. That's pretty good. The population holds 94% global wealth. That's pretty sweet. No, that's a lot, that's a lot of words there. I, was, I, was, I read the cover. That's enough. That's what I did with every single magazine. I was like, yeah, I get it. It's funny that she has the enough like like self awareness to like be like I need to get a change of clothing. All right. So oh, I should check the kitchen. In, in the car, I just I got a change of clothes from the trunk. Well, that's convenient. Yeah. Her size too. <laughs> yeah.
Bra nine. Bra nine. Four. The that's bird. A, that's a dead bird. Dead bird. Cool. Maybe it's an android bird. Mm, could be. The, we we just pick it up for it. Now your hands are all disease. You should know that. Know that. Money. Hey, Abraham Lincoln. Steal. Who's who's this stealing from? Ralph. Well, if the game says stated that it's chance of stealing. All right. Yep. No clothes there, unless the unless wa the watches in the future have clothes in them. Maybe the deer is wearing a dress. <laughs> Good farm area. Good farm area. Buying deer carcass. Hey, okay. well, it's gonna be upstairs. Pick up. Right. All of my all of my my gaming sens sensibilities are all messed up. Cause like I went up here before. I figured, well, this is an area to explore that I haven't been to yet. I should probably should check it out. But now you're supposed to explore. Now right? I'm supposed to come up here. Yeah. So. Ralph's just sleeping in the closet. Hi there. This is where this is where I sleep. Fancy, huh? Ralph is comfortable in the closet. There's mirrors inside the closet. That lining on, on the wall on the Ralph only doors. sees Ralph. Only Ralph in the closet. That closet has the same wallpaper on the inside as the wall. Weird. <laughs> yeah. Cut hair. Let's find something to cut. No, it's with. like a Barbie. It'll never grow. I know it sucks. Every every girl growing up that I, I'm aware of, my sister did, did did it. Cut their Barbie's hair at some point, and they never grew back. That's just gonna happen, you know. I mean, what if it did though? That'd be terrifying. Well, that would be the sign of a truly advanced robot. R robot. The um bathroom. What up? Oh man, just convenient things everywhere. David Cage games. You know you don't have to cut your hair because you always have it pinned up. You just so let, you it let, down, it, let it look down. Different. What did the trick here say? Uh, is it a rule that all disobeying robots need jackets? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I need uh, disorder jackets. What? Uh, sure. I picked white. I didn't know she could just do that. Right, so we're going to be doing that, yeah. Why can she do that? Why can she like retract her skin so she can get? No, it's not retracting. It's off. not retracting skin. It's the, it's the, um, the piece of the the robot uh, ha has the texture of skin, so it can like remove its. That texture. came off so easily. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Whatever. It turned out extremely well considering she couldn't see. <gasps> a dead man. A dead. A dead man. Well, she's a robot. She knows how to cut her hair. Yeah, I say that turned out pretty well, huh? Hi, dead man. I don't um, like. Uh, I don't like this. I think she was cuter before. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh. Well. I don't know. I think she's rocking the, the short hair. I prefer the longer hair. Me personally. too. But I mean, but, like, you, know. you can pull off short hair. Yeah. You can use, like, you can be a cute haircut when it's short. Yeah. It's a cute haircut. I think it looks a little too boyish, her hair. 
in my taste. Sure. Whoa, did you see that so man's so face go I'm, from low poly looking, to high poly? <laughs> I wish I had seen it. Look, 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 boom! Oh, oh. <laughs> on the replay. Okay, well, let me know if they turn anything up. You went from PS2 to PS4 really you quick. Sure did. The generation leap can hit you like a brick. Like a brick. No All right. So now you're playing both Connor and Car at the same time, which is cool. The first bus that mm. came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. It didn't have a plan. She is super pulling off the pixie yeah, cut. Oh, it no. is literally. Maybe it didn't go uh, far. I, I understand. He mean the fiddle. Is literally the most amazing cut. Or... <laughs> Ralph found this to feed the little girl. <laughs> it's good for her. A present. To make up for past misunderstandings. <laughs> Ralph will cook. We will do just like humans do. Humans like burnt meat. <laughs> Come and sit down. <laughs> uh, sure. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. Ah, uh, yes, I forgot about the completely sane robot. It wouldn't be polite for her to refuse, would it? <laughs> Is this gonna be like the uh, spoilers for those of you who haven't played um? Uh, what's the game he made? Heavy Rain. Succulent. This could be like a Heavy Rain situation, Succulent. like with Connor and Kara. <laughs> if so, I mean, that's pretty... I mean, a spoiler, that's just like something no. you'd expect. Oh, no. okay. Is it where I'm gonna be like tracking Kara? I know where... Uh... Or, I don't know. She said she can't wait to eat it. She's very hungry. The little human is not gonna regret it. <laughs> Ralph found the best, the biggest one you could find. <laughs> this is going to be succulent. Succulent. <laughs> Bird hoe from Futurama? Yeah, a little bit. Go ahead. Eat. If you can explain. Try to explain. Yeah. <laughs> Do robots not eat in this game? In this universe? No. I saw the body upstairs. You killed that human, didn't you? No. In Isaac Asimov's books, robots eat. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. It's just to... You killed that man, Ralph. There's no point in lying. You hate humans, but you're just like them. You're a murderer. Ralph didn't mean any harm. Just Ralph can't control his anger. When his anger comes, Ralph doesn't know what he's doing. He needs to be turned off. Stupid. Because mm -hmm. again, he's not a person, so you could just turn him off and without any moral quandary. He just wanted to be your friend. Then let us go. Anybody home? There's this right the did fence. not happen for me. Was here. Okay. Kara walked down the street while Connor was chasing her. But they were like not, not chasing, but she was like, I was doing a stealth section as Kara to get away. Gee, I wonder where Kara is. This is a this is a quandary, isn't it? Question mark. There's one question mark. Maybe just check around this corner. I didn't check. It's blocked off, I think. Because this feels like a very heavy rain thing. Where, like, you do the thing and it's like, now I'm going to solve the mystery of the guy I just played as. No. You know? Well, I mean, at least it wasn't for me. It might right. be for well, you. Who yeah. knows? We'll, we'll see.
like, I'm like, I'm sabotaging myself by like looking in the windows and stuff like that. So then what's, yeah, I can look, I can look over here now. Is there anything over here that I might need? Mm, nope. There's a door. I, can, I don't think you can go in it though, because there's no yellow there's no thing. No prompt right. for it. All That'd right. be pretty cool. Let's go in the door. That would be pretty cool. Go in the door. Prompt? Uh. Uh. Hang on, do I have to say this now? Let me scan first, I guess. Special skin damage, new heat. Okay. Mm, careful of his stress. I, I don't actually know what's going on here. I just saw it was right and going up. But if it's fine source, then you might want it to go up. I really don't know what to do here. Right. I would ask him questions. I'm looking for an AX400. Have you seen it? Ralph's seen nobody. <laughs> it takes this in the out or whatever. All right. Um... Are there any other androids here? Other androids? No. Ralph is alone. Okay. The kitchen door is shut. Sure is. Rest level is going down. Ask some questions about RA9, right? I remember that. Hmm, that's weird. Um. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Ralph scratched himself coming through. That's Ralph's blood. That check that. I guess upstairs is the only option. I guess uh, let me check. Let me check. Is a checking option here, right? Like, can I check here? Might go like, wait a second. No, I think it just means the stairs are interactable. There's also a body upstairs. And there's a go, it turns blue, even though it's at 80%. Because it's going down. Connor, what the hell you doing in there? Wait, wait, I want to ask that, do that last thing. Don't be afraid. I'm not gonna hurt you. Okay. Is anyone upstairs? No. Nobody. No body? No body? Body? Oh, I want to go upstairs. Huh. I can't go upstairs. Mm. I literally cannot go up the stairs again now. That's so dumb. Okay. Well. There's got to be something else we're missing. 
Like, he's just gonna not go up the stairs even though he's exploring the whole house. He's gonna, he's gonna trust the, the, tw the twitchy robot who's clearly lying. <laughs> But no, this is the one time he's gonna not gonna gonna. Let's find the source of his stress. It was your objective, right? Thought so. Find the source of stress. Is this it? Is it here? Oh yeah, look at that. There's a hatch. Oh no, it's just under the stairs. Run quick, Kara! Connor, what's going on? It's here! Call it in! Which way did it go? That way. They're headed for the train station. Well, so now you play this section from Connor's perspective, I guess. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Good, I guess, huh? Physics on his coat's really nice. Oh, not that one. <laughs> <laughs> so you said that I wanted to test that just how nice but it like, that's, stay. But like that looks nice, right? That's pretty good. They're over there. That guy's mouth did not move. No. Can I like run slower? Probably not. Don't shoot, we need it alive! Story would have been over right there. Yep. Hopefully you're good at these. Uh... Woo! Hey, where are you going? I can't let them get away. They won't. They'll never make it to the other side. I can't take that chance. Hey, you will get yourself killed. Do not go after him, Connor. That's an order. It said like um software instability there. Why did it say that? Um I think because I think it's because you are following it's it's like a contradiction. You are following the orders of Hank like you're supposed to, but you're not following the orders of Amanda, which is to find the deviant. Right. So I think it's supposed to be like a contradiction in your program. Mm, I guess. I don't know. Like I so I saw that all the time and it didn't do anything, to my mm. knowledge. So it's probably just there for set dressing, honestly. Might be. I don't know what's creepier, that the androids blink or that they, they wouldn't blink? They wouldn't blink. Because it's, it's more in, in more sort of uncanny valley, I think. Yeah. But it's weird that they blink, too. Yeah, yeah, it is. Dude, racking up all the points! Oh, we've gotten points. Look at that. Dude! Connor avoids collision. Kara loses honor. It's just Kara. There's only thing up here, though, I thought. That was stressful. Kara's my favorite. No, it's all about Connor, man. <laughs> Kara's um, second best. Marcus we sucks. safely. All right. Well, I mean, I only really know that much. I mean, I feel like I don't... I really met Marcus very well, very much. Painter. But. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigations. We contacted Cyberlife for comment, but no these sections. Yet another reason Marcus sucks. Okay. These find Jericho sections are so long. <laughs> I 
All right, so you're looking for that square QR code thing. Okay, well, I mean, we have have a little bit of an assistance here, so. Use the right the stick to find the symbol in the graffiti. There it is. Ah, remember that thing that happened 30 minutes ago? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Find this graffiti. Good, how about you? Like half lion face. Are you fast walking right now? I'm walking normally. Is there a fast walk? I it just seems one just seems to be a one toggle. Can't slow walk. No no no. Isn't there a button you can hold to fast walk? Was there? Isn't it one of the triggers? I think so. I don't see no, it. No, I thought there was. Like X? What about like R1? That's the camera change. What about L1? No, try that. Press start, go to the controls, let's just see. You're right. Mind Palace. <laughs> Mind Palace. <laughs> I, th I thought there was a fast walk. I guess not. You're looking for the half lion. It's not necessarily in this room. Right. Railway machine causes panic in Camden. Uh, with miles of unspoiled nature, Canada is the true land of the free. Um, President Warren to make a state visit to United Kingdom. Oh. Killer ads. Future's here. Could be over there, game. Fine. If I was been put, making, putting graffiti on stuff, I'd put it in a weird place. Leave it to be confirmed. Sort of religious cult? Ro robot cult? See the half lion face. I see the symbol in it. Jericho is. You'd figure they would at least program them with a response mm -hmm. if, if they're talked to. Really weird. You know what this reminds me of? Assassin's Creed? Yeah, the Assassin's Creed 2 and you gotta find the pieces of Eden. Yeah. Like it. Gameplay was not engaging there. <laughs> Not engaging here either. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Thanks right, for making so fun of my laugh. Sheesh. I see it. Do you see it? Yeah, yeah. Rainbow. It doesn't make it fun of your laugh. But there's so much to see, though. What is not that? really. I for I'm As a guy you. that spent a lot of time here, there's not really. <laughs> I was like, okay, there's got to be something here. There's nothing here, to my, to my knowledge. Oh, I see two of them. I mean, if you if this was actually like this, you'd be like, who who messed up the yeah the, the painting? Like, why did a whole bunch of people get stars and then two guys wanted to make weird like ninja star squares? Yeah, that's terrible. We have that decommissioned. Robot house. Garbage day. Garbage day. Okay, let's see. Memes. Oh, behind you. Through that fence, boom, right there. Uh, da, 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 da. let's see, it's probably in the robot somewhere. I don't know, I, do, do, don't you find like, um, spot the difference and stuff kind of fun? Yeah, but this is not spot the difference. This is look for the square. <laughs> well, I guess. Third robot. Fourth robot. And ah, I see it's a different color. It's a third though. Gotta get around. Hold. Hold down. There we go. I think there is one section with Marcus that I was like. 
All the other ones were like, uh, okay. All the other ones were, were this. I thought the, the painting like part was kind of interesting. Yeah, sure. That was actually, actually that, that was good. That was good too. But like post. Post ro robot post ro junkyard. Rogue, post rogue. Hmm. There's only like one or two scenes with him that I'm like, oh, okay. Can't go back for some reason? Nope, only forward. Would you think you had some freedom? Uh, I'm kind of glad that I don't because I'd be left wandering. But. Look at that shark. What? Oh, that one. <laughs> There's a lot of uh, graffiti, like really nice graffiti around here. Graffiti? Graffiti. You're here. not seeing the whole painting. Huh. Lock puzzles. Okay. Um, I'm a thing. I think you're also going to find something that Marcus can do a little bit later very funny. Because I found it hilarious. I'm excited about that. So funny. Parkour. I think they programmed the parkour the parkour module. module. Oh, we had the same word in mind. Okay, uh, yep, scan that sucker there. One more. It's white. Wait. Ah, oh, there it is. Wow, this is some compelling gameplay. This is why Marcus is such a great <laughs> character. <laughs> yeah, Marcus super sucks. Not very fun. The guy who played him did a great job, though. Yeah. Reconstruct. Reconstruct. The right stick to select the. So, do you like Prince of Persia? Uh, well, yeah, I liked, liked it well enough. What the heck? <laughs> okay. Com com yeah, computate. There you go. Execute. Androids can just do that. Yeah. We probably shouldn't program them to do that. Program them to do that. It's to like, be parkour masters? Yeah, I know. This dude get a wall run? Yeah, man. He does more than just wall run. Of course. Sparkle City. <gasps> and it's a spark plug. Uno. Dose. Man, sparkle. Oh. It's Horace. Dude, that seems like something they shouldn't program into robots, or they could make great assassins. Right? Not be solid enough, okay. I have to actually push the rewind button. Computate. Not just compute. It is compute. Okay, yeah. it's like absolutely not computate, but at this point, I'm too <laughs> afraid to bring it up. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even get to watch it all in real time. I thought we already watched it. Yeah, you're right. I'd rather just have a cutscene of him doing. 
rather than a well, isn't, isn't that way? most of what this pick game this is? Way. Is no. like oh, I just have a cutscene. Just if, it, if the game is you know for, if Kara's first little chapter is like doing chores, why don't you just show her doing the chores? Yeah. Watching them. But you really gotta feel it. Yeah. You can overdo it though. I think I think like the way The Walking Dead did it, the first one. Yep. Did that really well. And that, but then like doing doing it too much can be a bad thing. Okay. Are you here? No, I'm behind you. I remember there being a broken down. Uh, I have the colorful wall. stuff. Hmm. Let's see. Ah, it's a lucky emblem. Kingdom Hearts Three. There's lucky. There's thing called lucky emblems that have that are around and they're like Mickey the, Mouse heads. It's a it's a Riddler trophy. Yeah, but sometimes sometimes it's like it's like this where like yep. it's perspective. Yep, like Riddler trophies. Yeah. At least the fun ones. The fun ones. Some Riddler trophies are like, you made it to the top of this building, Batman. Good thing there's 700 of these. How could you? It's impossible. I'm the Riddler. Do you remember when we did that for when I was doing the yeah. Arkham Knight review? And I was like, okay, I want 100% this game for so I can review, review it properly. Yeah. And Because there's a fight. Yeah. So I was like, I don't want to not see that content. Yeah. Um... So we, like, and we just went through it yeah. with, a, with a walkthrough. Like, those, that was fun, but there was, like... Isn't there like 250 of them or there something like that? Quite a it was bit a of them. lot. I mean, of we them. spent some time on that. But it was a fun way to spend an evening because it, it was yeah, just hanging it, out. It, yeah, it was fun. But it was also like, what the heck? How are you ever supposed to figure that out? Right. Each of the boats. Jericho is a ship. Okay. On. How convenient it all came tumbling down. Right as we were crossing. Bridge fall down. You not get. Uh, jump. <laughs> I already said I wanted to jump, and it's like, well, I'll do it. Ro roll to jump. Why isn't there a prompt for every one of these steps? That's unrealistic. You know? Because that's stupid. You're stupid. Maybe I'm just more of an it. more of an uh, artiste than you are. Again, is it just me? Like, wouldn't wouldn't people be here to kind of like? Oh, there's a rotting ship on the on the. It's Detroit. Uh, I guess. They have robots. They have like highly advanced robots here. It's Detroit. Dude, that's like uh, me for the hidden Mickeys in Kingdom Hearts 3. I try to find as many as I can in each zone, but some are impossible yeah. without a walk. So, so some of them are actually pretty well hidden. Some I came across. across uh, I just so happened to come across them by accident. I was staying at the right angle to see the shape. There's one in uh, the Kingdom of Corona that I was like, what? That's. It's, yeah, I do um, love me some perspective puzzles. Yeah, those are pretty neat. I, I do. They're kinda, they're this kinda is fun. how Marcus, uh, his tail ends. He just jumps to his death. Flash? There he is. Also, Android shouldn't be able to swim. Uh, mm. No, his jacket! Oh, his, his cool guy jacket's gone. Go back again and get it. Yeah, you don't even have the option. Thanks, game. Broken, broken swimming mechanics. Swimming mechanics. Find a way to see. Is that what it said? Mm -hmm. It's dark. It, it, oh, I guess, I guess, for him. Also, how come there is never anyone around for Marcus's story? Just wait. We'll get oh, man, I'm waiting. We'll get surrounded by some Dude, insufferable people soon. I am waiting for the, the David Cage, like, what a twist! Uh, where everyone's actually aliens or something. Everyone's a robot? Yeah, everyone's a robot. And the batteries die. That's how these kind of flashlights work. 
for like five seconds. Okay, what? Well, explore boat. My boat. I always do make that joke and no one ever gets it. You don't, and you never get it. No, what the heck is it's it? It's from Waterworld. Yeah, okay, I haven't seen a Waterworld in oh, at never, never least seen 15 years. Did you see it? Yes. Oh. When I was like 10. Kevin Costner, you know, he's, he's a guy living on, on the ocean, right? Mm -hmm. It's all of that that there is. So, bandits come and they destroy his boat. This, this, like, this is his house, his home. He just spots when he finally returns from, from, a, from, from the adventure. My boat. So, that's kind of... Did he have a new bigger boat? What, Did what? he have a bigger boat? No, that was just his only boat. Oh, okay. With all of his stuff on it. My boat. <laughs> it's like, you know, like, you, you have those moments where it's where it's just like over-the-top cheese, like like Nicolas Cage cheese, not the bees and all that, right? A, B, C, D. Then you have the other and direction. And then there's the other direction, right? My boat, or Lost in Space's I love you, wife. Come on, let's go. Let's see the cult. Robot cult. Here we go. A Rolt. 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 Well, it seems weird that this one opened. Uh, let me look at the corner. I walked right past these rooms. Yeah, but I didn't even know you could open them. That's why I walked by them. Right. I feel like you're like you're meant to. Oh, you definitely are. Them, definitely are. But that just shows the divergent gameplay style. Oh man, emergent gameplay, my favorite. <laughs> that doesn't show that at all. Why did it scream like that? That's kind of an odd thing to do. Same reasons why Metal Gear is so real. It'd actually be more freaky if there wasn't a noise. And it didn't do anything. Like, it didn't go do the zoom. Yeah, it's like the same. Like, uh, yeah, it's like, um... Uh, whoa, what's it called? The, the, the Home Invaders. It's a movie about, about Home Invaders. Okay. And the guy's, like, standing behind the... The Strangers. The Strangers. It's a great movie. And it's really creepy because, like, he's just standing he's, there. He's, yeah, he... It's not there's, a jump scare. A, there's a scene where... He sta it's like a it's like a like a forty five second scene, and he's standing there the whole time. Yeah. And you don't notice him until she leaves and it focuses on him. Yeah. And you're like, oh. He was all right there. <laughs> and it's really cool. It's really subdued and like it's not a jump scare. It's like, oh, I gotcha. He's just standing there staring at. Him. Yeah, it's it's really really good. The scream for the spooks, Ovs. It's true, but it was it's less spooky now because of the scream. Because now it's tropey. It's trophy. See, yeah. when, when there's like a, <laughs> it takes you out of the moment. It breaks your immersion yeah, for like, a second. The, the, the orchestra like sting. Even even if it gets you, you're like, oh, oh okay. Oh, that's so annoying. Stop you know what it. I mean? Yeah. Where it's like, if it just happened, you're like, uh, yeah, yeah, I agree. I agree. Because there's no fanfare, you're like, did I it, actually see that? Because it helps with the atmosphere when it just happens. Like, it's like, ah! it's like, oh, okay, that attention is now, it's not gone. You know. Did you know there's a guy that is uh, <laughs> that's going around trying to scare streamers on PUBG? No. So he wears uh, this like full demented clown costume and runs around with an axe. Okay. And he tries to find streamers by stream sniping them, but he never kills them because he always has like a melee weapon and it sucks in PUBG. So what he does is he tries to find where they're going and he waits in the house okay. and he waits behind the door in this clown mask. So you open the door and there's just a clown right in front of you. Uh, I was watching a Doctor Disrespect clip and he ran into it and he killed it. Oh! And then he just he just stood up and walked off camera and you heard him go like, "What the heck, dude?" And he just came back. Yeah, and he was yeah, like, yeah. "All right, all right." <laughs> like, it's amazing. That's so good. Silence of the strangers is great. Yeah. The second one sucked. Yeah, because like yeah, it's easy, it's easy to get get chief scared with jump scares, right? Like. Not even really scary. It's more of a startle. It's just, they're different. I saw him do not disrespect. Yeah, it's great, man. It's so funny. Welcome to Jericho. <gasps> That's the same guy that got shot in the roof. Again. What? Why is he still alive? I shot him. 
or whatever. Well, no, there's multiple models, dude. Yeah, the really loud noise of the jump scares always pulls me out of the movie. Yeah. It's great. Yeah. I missed a thing. I missed another thing. I missed these things. No, I, honestly, I'm I'm okay with it. You get points though. Yeah, points. But, but these scenes would take forever. Points though. Chicken. Chicken for feed. The Isaac Asimov's books. You you robots could eat, but um, not because they needed it. It's, it was to, to appear human. So would they just like walk somewhere and like go clean out their? They stomach? had like a like a bag in their stomach. Like, the stomach. Hey, listen, I got a Shit hot tip you gave me. Send me back a week's wages, baby. Come on. This is different. Game, it's 100% guaranteed. Yeah. It is. Good catch. We got right food hygiene license. Hmm. Interesting. Go on him. Gambling and fraud. Yeah. Very good. When arresting, resisting arrest, breach of hygiene regulations, right? Hey, all just clean shaven stuff? What kind of record? This guy looks really young for how old he is. He's like from 19, he's born 1988. Oh, yeah, we are in 2030 something. Yeah. Yeah, Dang. that's true. I didn't think about that. Well, average life expectancy's gone up. Maybe 91. we finally hit the aging right, of the in. Japanese people. Damn. Where we don't age until we're 70. <laughs> and we age rapidly. Yeah. That's also how a lot of black men age. Yeah? Yeah, yeah I guess it's There's like a lot so. of black men that are like, Wow, you you look great. How old are you? 60? You look like you're 30. Yeah, that's true. They, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. They, How old are you? 61? You look 80. Yeah. They, like, it yeah, happens all one they, time. They, it's they, crazy. They can age gracefully, too. Yeah. It's crazy. Like, Samuel um, Jackson aged really well in Morgan Freeman. Yeah, yeah, totally. And you look at, like, like Brendan so. Fraser. And I'm like, sorry for my behavior. Mm -hmm. I didn't mean to be on the bus. Oh, wow. You've even got a brown nose and a at Cyberlife thought everything, huh? There you go. Burger. I unlock something. Like oh, soda. look at that. So 184 grams of sugar. I have passion. Carbonated. 710 uh, calories. I want to drink bubbly right now yeah dude denzel uh, washington is like 64 or something yeah he right? looked, yeah he does not look 64. yeah is he really yeah holy cow yeah. that is some graceful just agent. google hideo kojima and you're like right you're, no. you're 50 half of the video game directors in japan uh, they they don't, do not look as old as they everywhere. are wait can i talk to you oh one which is not the same hockey game same game same, same, different different footage yeah yeah those stands. Okay, I'll have, that stands. Those stands are all right. On the left. Come on. Hockey's a fun sport. Uh, That's the same clip. This is the same clip. Same clip. There you go. All right. Wow, what? Is there no chairs here? This Pedro, he was proposing illegal gambling. Am I right? Yeah. And you made a bet. Yeah. Um. I don't want to alarm you, Lieutenant, but I think your friends are engaged in illegal activities. Dude, Matt. Oh, jeez. Masayoshi Soken. Yep. Masayoshi Soken. Uh, he's 44. A dude looks like he's 20 or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, highway. This morning, when we were chasing those deviants, why didn't you want me to cross the highway? 
because you could have been killed. I, and I don't like filling out paperwork for damaged equipment. Ah. Uh, okay. Um. I'm starting to like you. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um. Why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate androids so much? I have my reasons. Yeah, I'm, I'm asking them, actually. I'm asking them. <laughs> asking for those reasons. Maybe I should tell you what we know about defense. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead yeah, to them Mavericks. emulating a Maybe an X bust some. Bam, bam, bam. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. <laughs> you ever dealt with deviants before? This dude is straight out of iRobot. He, I have. He just doesn't. Oh, he does. Back. He does remember. A deviant was threatening to jump. Yeah, off you're the, the same the little girl. The I, same. I think someone in chat the last time said that he doesn't remember. Oh. So I guess you've done all your homework. Oh right? yeah, I think it's it might be every time the past the first time. Mm -hmm. I don't remember. Uh, 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 truth. I don't know what he asked. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. So what's your conclusion? Um, here. I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge, but Adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. Uh, I'm not winking. I'm just I'm twitching. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so, bug in the system. It's a few blocks away. So he hates robots at the same time. Uh, in the. So he hates robots the same reason the main character and I robot hates robots exactly. Oh uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Maybe that's why this this works the best because yeah because it's just I robot. He ripped, 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 ripped off Isaac Asimov. Yeah. Who's a brilliant science fiction writer. Yeah. That, no, legitimately, that's why I you like Connor. Of, you run out of batteries yeah. or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh, well, if you're gonna rip, rip, rip someone off, rip off. No. One who knows how to do I'm it, coming. I guess. A little unfair to call it to rip off, but Question they're very similar. The subject. Guy. Not so much. like that interaction with Hank, that was Just really nice. That was good. I like that. that. See what I mean? It was, it was thoroughly floor. enjoyable. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ. If we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange <laughs> noise, we're going to need more cops. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Just by closing your eyes? Correct. Shit. Wish I could do that. Let me, uh, Livia, rock pigeon, comprised of different species. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit police! Stay behind me. Got it. Frame rate. Oh, particle that effects. Was, that was nasty. I'm a robot. I should just scan my surroundings. Mazes. Mazes, mazes within mazes. What the fuck is this? Ugh. Jesus, 
This place stinks. Bridge. Well, uh, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. Oh, Smith doesn't eat. Smith doesn't eat. Doesn't need to. It's a robot. <gasps> what? <laughs> Arms of Detroit. Roots and that's get where, uh, gettables. That's where uh, Ralph was from. Yeah, Ralph was from there. Yeah. He lives in the heart of the city. Oofed. Yeah. Fruits and gettables are in town. Booster corner. They moved. I'm going to take this phone call on stream. Oh, okay. As he decides that he called me and then immediately hung up. Oh, it's... What? I need some fresh air. I cannot hear you. Hold on. Found something? What's up? I don't know. It looks like a no. Notebook, yes. But it's indecipherable notebook. Indecipherable. Okay. Yeah, what's up? Uh, she should be. It, uh, she might be sleeping. Why are there so many pigeons in here? <laughs> yeah, just go for it. Yep. Just be quiet if she is. Come oh, here. Got a yep, question bite. mark. Ram suspect is suspect is suspect is deviant. Find cause of loud noise and then one question. Why would there be so many pigeons in here? Cause robots love life. Mufuki. Oh no. You know who hates life? Humans! Oh no. Who is the real monster? Robots. Yes. Um, 90% cotton, 10% synthetic. RT. Probably initials. Robert. Put his initials in his jacket. Rundle. That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Tamberlay. Rupert Travis. Robert Audrey. Topanga. The driver's that's a, that's license a, is Topanga. fake. That's cool. a little Boy Meets World yeah, reference for you. Is that a Canadian thing? Do, do people in America know uh, no, that? No, that, that's an American show. It's an American show. Oh, okay. Get out of here. Dude, Mr. Feeny was so Mr. great. Mr. Feeny. Old barn. Wild animals. And mazes, though. Why mazes? Ah, Jesus, I hate these things. You watch your mouth, Clancy. Any idea what it means? Dude, there is no money in the world that would get me to enter. Oh my room. gosh, yeah, Trocar, yeah. yeah. He doesn't, this is not like birds. birds are, I love birds. It's the same sign Ortiz is I, I on the show. Trocar, I'm not record saying that. No money in the world. Trocar, I owned a bird for a while. It was great. Looks like a parakeet. Or something. Should, we, should we solve the maze? Writing yet? Birds are great. I think they're so cool. We had chickens on, on, on my on my farm when I was growing up. Oh, we had to feed them and make sure they whenever they got out, you had to like round them up again. Mm -hmm. They're really, you know, they're skittish, so you yeah. have to do a. One of my friends um, owned chickens. They used to go over, go help feed them, and like when they yeah when they get out, they they would love me. They'd like flock around me and just pick them up. Yeah. You gotta put them back in their pen, otherwise the um. And the coyotes would get, we'll get him. Yeah. Yeah, sure is. Are you going to hold triangle? There you go. Play room. Real books. I thought I was the last guy to try. Electronic books, you can't smell the pain. Blue blood. Missing. Paper. See the pages turning yellow. Got his thing. You have no idea what I'm talking about. I don't the It's LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. Okay. Cause of loud noise. 
I'm still not even paying attention. What loud noise what, what are we talking about? There was a bang. Is there a bang? Yeah. I can't believe it. This nut job was actually feeding these fuckers. Fingerprint is here. Mm hmm. No fingerprints. You figure no, they, a robot wouldn't have prints. Right, but you figure they would. You would want to give them fingerprints, some kind of identification, like so if they touched. I don't know. I guess no, it wouldn't matter because they would never commit crimes. And so. Yeah. No steel. Jeez. Toward entrance. Mm -hmm. Move the camera around too. We've cleared everything here. Yep. Ah! Goddamn fucking pigeons! What are you waiting for? Chase it! Okay, so you are doing this. I certainly am. Run, 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 scan. Uh, so what this means is you don't have time. Yep. Fast is faster prompts. Okay. Uh. Camera for pointing me in the right direction here. Yep. On the train. That's how you know you're cool. <laughs> Holy shit! You know, it, uh, you know, you don't really find much. Uh, you won't find much, too much traction on a train or for train. No. You'd also land on it and immediately go woo woo. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen the gifts. See? Hey, good job, dude. Um. So I also saved Hank. Um. So basically, what that was showing was if you didn't save him, he would have an 89% chance of surviving the fall. Right. Uh. But Hank's obviously like, why don't you let me fall, dude? Right. We know what it looks like. We'll find it. Those are good odds of survival. Yeah, pretty yeah. good odds. That's why I was kind of thinking maybe I wouldn't, just because the odds were good. Hey, Connor. I think it makes sense to also save him. Nothing. I'm like assigned to him. I'm a robot. Also, Hank's a great dude. My job is to text him and stuff. 
I think that makes sense. Well, I was just gonna catch the culprit, but I think human life, the immediate action of trying to save human life. Um, that's what I'm talking about, man. It's a robot. Yeah. You save the the human with the highest chance of survival. Yeah. And I mean, he was, you know, there was no immediate danger there. Oh, the, back to this loser. Dude. Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. Hey, Josh. Hi, Simon. Hi, North. North. Um. And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. It's not, I guess, placed out of the middle of nowhere. Or... Because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. This is a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. Hiding just to stay alive. That's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. Few succeed. Humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel. But we have that one quiet kid. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate oh, it. Oh, thank you. It will show up eventually. Yes. With Streamlabs, but they're super slow. Oh yeah, it shows up. Maybe I was never made really free. Maybe I was only what my master wanted me to be. And now, I need to decide who I really am. You can't you're really lost. because you've been programmed. Just like the rest of us. You're you subject to the one who created you. Now, ultimately, you can. Make decisions within that framework, but ultimately you're safe here. Come on now. You can stay with us as long as you want. Obviously, treading some trodden ground uh, philosophically here. You. you know we couldn't just have a good time in a David Cage game. Yeah. We had to be asked some philosophical question. That don't really that, that, that if, really if, that deep. if you think about it for thirty seconds, you're like, yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> All right. There it is. Yeah, there it is. Thanks, man. Do you know what happens after death? No. No, I don't. Hi, I'm Lego the Android sent by Cyberlife. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed, and they sent me to replace it. Uh, this incident should not affect the investigation. All right. Well, that's good. We don't need any more interference with investigations. Oh no, she's dead. You just put a battery in her and she's fine. No, she's all right. She'll be all right. Sorry, just spaced out there for a second. Okay, so we got we got some pretty good parts to work with here. Like we got we got an entire an, a whole uh like you know, the whole uh, system there, you know? Yeah. See, that's why I like Until Dawn more. It tells much uh, more of a fun and contained story. I agree. Hmm. Drop Marcus, and you just have uh, Kara and Connor, and I think this game is a lot better. Uh, so far, I, I really do like Connor. I like that Connor is like a robot, and he knows he's a robot. Yeah. And, like, it's like a fun... I don't Kara know. knows she's a robot, but she's like, I have to protect this girl. Yeah, whereas, like, I don't know. Connor's like... Is the the tr The tired, like... like Philosophical question that's being asked here. For, for this is happening, Connor's story. Connor's story is just, yeah, I'm a robot, so like I'm gonna help you solve crimes. Mm -hmm. That sounds cool. You know? Not in very good shape, am I? Drop Kara and Alice in this game would be good. Uh, I say awesome. keep Kara and Alice, drop Marcus, and this game would be good. I don't think you would have anything good to say anyway. What hmm. happened to you? Just because Kara and Alice actually brings up some questions that aren't so like <gasps> robots are humans, That's a human, right? Though. Like there's there's it does, but it's like it also brings up some other questions, which are at least like again, they're thirty second think tank 
deep. Sort of. They're I am right, fourteen yeah. and this is deep. Yeah. Questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know. I get you. Really, you just I just want a whole game of Connor. You just oh. take that robot back from the robot uh, to the uh, back to the robot graveyard and see if there's any parts there. Easy fix. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good, eh? Where do we get the lighter? Oh, uh, we have our ways. It's probably in our back pocket after, after we uh, robo deleted. Delete. 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 Find Lucy, man. So many things to find, though. This, are you Lucy? Uh, Lucy, you a child robo? Why'd you make child robos? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets. Before child robo is the worst idea. Yeah, it's not a good idea. idea. We don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. Gee, I wonder where we can find those. I know, right? Dude, it was obviously in the jacket you stole from the robot graveyard pile. So, how do they Garbage pile. Grave <laughs> Garbage pile is more accurate. They won't. We're slowly dying out. Like, okay, Josh just just said that like, like it was very somber. Like, we oh, dying. Walked away, and we're all, and then Marcus is like. You know, like that? Like, oh no. The dude was like half half there. He was shot in the head. Shot in the head. His eye was all messed up. He had, like, you know, like out. He lost most of his legs. He just salvaged some for parts. And he, he's, he, look at him. He's fine. Better than ever. His core, whatever, his like thermal combustor, or whatever it's called. We got a, we got a, we got a fresh one right here. I guess I mean they're they're all humany now, so they're gonna they're not gonna go ahead and cannibalize the, this one. You're not you're not talkable. Not you. That's just more light. More light. You don't need that. Can't walk through that. Hello. North. I do not like North very much. How long have you been here? Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Isn't that, is it? It's m m must be fun to yeah, do to do that with the ball, knowing that you'll never you'll never miss it. Yep. A lot of these guys are in pretty bad shape. We're guaranteed to catch it every time. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. We'll never accept what we are. I don't know who Minka Kelly is. Who found Minka this place? Kelly. Must be a voice actress. Mm. Or or maybe that actress. Or maybe the actress, yeah. That's really... Whoever he was, his body's probably laying somewhere on this boat. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. Good to be in high spirits when you're I'm like that. Are you done talking? Alright. Done talking. You guys don't want to talk. That's a barrel, that's a barrel. That's a the barrel. Box. The box over here. Box. Look, there's a, there are parts. Parts. So we're more, see, we're not just like you know, making stuff up here. Lucy. Okay, I looked it up and it, it is Minka Kelly. Huh. There's a fresh arm right there. Fresh arm right there. Look at that. Come on. Yep. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna go up the stairs. Nope. Okay, never mind. I thought maybe that's where we were headed because the camera was kind of pointing me in that direction. See if you can go up the stairs, if that guy will let you go up. Oh, okay. Ready? 
Right on. Um, oh, go behind the, the curtain. Are you Lucy? Sit down. No. What should I have? I have no such agency. I am also a robot. I need Sitting down procedure. I prefer to stand. Complete. Yes. Show me. You know what does a better job and more fun way of uh, telling this story? Near Automata. <laughs> From the just from the little I've seen of the story of Nier Automata, yeah, <laughs> like the idea of like humans being ro or robots being humans and what does it I'll mean to be a me. human and, and and all that. Oh, are you really living if you if you're a robot? And... Drink this. I feel like I shouldn't take it because I'm, I'm like my processing majigger healed me up pretty good. That was like a mess when I started. Oh, yeah, I started. You guys need it more than I do. Give me your hand. <laughs> this could just be a cutscene. I don't yep. need to like sit down, stand up, give me your hand. You had it all, and you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Sorry, I'm a theater robot. I was, uh, that was a lesson in my... <laughs> I was a thespian robot before this happened. I'm sorry. Where's heat in a spot? Where's my grapes? He doesn't bot. What are they doing? Propose a plan to Simon. Simon, you're, you're Simon. Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. I guess they you can go there as well. Need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need. You guys can't, like, like download we'll ourselves data? Maybe. Stuff? What kind of robots are What is this writing, and why are they trying to I'm make this mystic-type character work here? Because it doesn't work at all. No, I, I was thinking the same thing, Trogear. Why don't we like go to the the you know junk garage pile, and we just like put lots of arms and legs on one one of the robots and make him like make the, our, a giant our champion. Robot? We'll make him make him like like a, like a champion. Like it's like the Goliath of the robots. We sick, and then we can fight the the, the, the Goliath robot. We super sick. Yeah. No. It'd it's be like, like, like friggin' he he hecaton chair. That'd be awesome. Yeah. It's been raining okay. for like a billion years. It's Detroit. Around here. That's, uh, we'll get some help here. It's just uh, Detroit company. isn't like. It's like that's just, uh, just what happens when there's a lot of smog. Oh. It's just raining chemicals. Yeah, that's right. Oh dear. It's acid rain. Acid rain. Acid rain. That's, that's a good word. 
It's, yeah, it's, it's they don't need to steal. There's a garbage pile full of parts. Yeah, and but all they need them, blue blood. Not all of them worked. They but, need blue blood. That's but, what they need. Yeah. And I guess once the blue blood's been in the robot for a while, it needs to be in, like oil. I guess. This is, uh, that, that could be it. Acid rain. Especially, yeah, acid, acid rain is a cool name for like a like skills and stuff in a, in a game, like a spell in the game. Contextual hand holding. The future is now. The future is now. Contextual hand holding. <laughs> oh no, I'm malfunctioning. <laughs> <laughs> Cannot stop. Can't stop the spins. Can't stop the spins. Carousel protocol activated. <laughs> Are you Zlatko? Who? who, who? Who's asking? I was told to By who? Did I miss that? I don't know who told I you that. I don't Can't remember who place. told you here. A person Wait, told me in my game about Zlocko. We really need your help. So I don't... But a guy that you didn't meet. Right. Wait, how did you meet him? Uh, there was, like, uh, talk about... There was a few, mm. like, um, mm. robots somewhere that were, like... Because I didn't escape... By running across the highway, I escaped in a train, and in the train, I overheard robots talking about Zlocko, oh. who takes in robots. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I don't know who Zlocko is. Don't be shy. This comes out. Of, this for me is coming out of nowhere. So, yeah, that's not a good thing from the storytelling. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? What's up? I'm huge. Oh, don't be afraid. Later. Hey, Peter. Luther spinach puffs. <laughs> he keeps me company. This Dude, Luther is massive. Big, Absolute use. Massive. Yeah. That painting of that disturbing little girl in the background. Did you see that? Uh, Look at that. Whoa, a sister. I will eat you. Who would want that in their house? Make yourselves at home. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he's- Oh, no, that's house. right. The dude in green. In green? That was I like- Oh, was he even there? That guy. Remember? You got off the bus and there was a dude. You had somewhere you could stay for the night. Mm -hmm. And he said a thing yeah. and then the bus drove by and then you looked back and he wasn't there. Oh, like yeah. But why wasn't he there, though? I don't, I, I don't understand yeah, that. It'll get explained. Yeah. I think. It probably won't. It's David Cage. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Yeah, the other half of the year. Oof. Beautiful landscapes. You get what they're going for right now? Open spaces. Clean air. Oh, uh, yeah. The Underground Railroad. And no yeah, okay. laws. As long as you get it, because Great they're like... For a fresh start. Hey! Canada <laughs> safe! <laughs> I'll take you there with some sort of underground some railway. Sort of railroad, underground. It wasn't actually a railroad, but... No. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on. Follow me. Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. Contextual hand holding. You're really in love with that contextual hand holding, aren't you? It's cool. Pretty right nifty, I guess. Everything it's like in The Witcher in the 3. I like how your facial hair grows in real time. Dude, should I give Witcher 3 another chance? It's on sale for $16 right no, now. No, dude. You tried already. Dude, nothing gets explained. Instead, they have uh, they'll have another scene where a mystic robot will speak more nonsense. Ah, <laughs> uh, you are robot. Uh, light and dark. Uh, find the balance of only the two. Uh, only a human deals in absolutes. <laughs> huh. This is this opens up a whole other look. It's Jesus. It's yeah. It's the um, Catholic depiction of him, at least. So, that's such an absurd, like, on, like on its face. Like, if you think about it for five seconds, it's like, only a Sith deals in absolutes. Uh, you just made an absolute statement by saying that. <laughs> I've never thought about it that way before. 
I'm just like, well, everyone deals in absolutes. Like, you know how you're hungry. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, <laughs> I never thought of it like that before. Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> I'm absolutely hungry. I absolutely know I need water or I will die. And that man. Let's go. I have a bad feeling. But uh, I'm pretty sure that's not what they're going for. They're going for more of like a... Like a he's a bit odd. Like um, can trust him. a philosophical... Yeah, absolutely. which is why I, I, I take the philosophical route. Like that, that is a, itself is a, a, an absolute statement, and therefore it, 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 it sounds deep, but really it doesn't trackers follow. Is illegal, so I opted for discretion over no, don't, don't pull a Blair Witch on me. What do you think you're doing over there? Scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. Oh, I guess I guess I'm meant to go over yeah, here. Yeah, you have to go get her. Come on, Alice. What, what is she looking at here? Unlock the door. Way, Can't interact with that. Check on Alice. <laughs> I should just periodically just like, let go of my hand. <laughs> like. <laughs> Okay, sweet. Look at this bits and bobs right here. Okay, so the Blair Witch Project is bad, right? Never seen it. I want to see bad, it. Right. Uh, if you could just stand over there. Uh, I think for its time, it did some interesting things because it, it was novel, but I don't think it's. It, it was like, like the whole, first found footage film. Yeah, right? I don't think you know, I don't, it's questionable if it holds up or not. But it did some things that were kind of interesting, but not. In the middle, I don't know. It was a very boring film, ultimately. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. But it was kind of creepy, creepy because nothing happened really in it. You know, it just kind of the way it ended was sort of spooky. You know what's strange? Yeah, that's true, but it doesn't hold up well. For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in deviance that's why it's so hard to find them <laughs> so actually there's no reason to remove your tracker also this dude is clearly a bad guy right yes yeah people believe what they want you deviants are so naive they all come to me expecting me to help them and i just reset them oh sell them on Oh, we sell them. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No! I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's, that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Y'all ready? It's probably, I mean, if, if this ain't anything like, like, like formatting a computer, even right, if I decided this now, it would all, it would just Switch ruin everything. Having a dream. It always ends up the same way. Tears and disillusion. Believe me, you're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. No more hopes dashed. I almost envy you. Kara! Yeah, except <laughs> what? Oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, what happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. Okay. You bit me. I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. Carl, wake up, Carl. Eight percent. Meet me in the living room. 
Right, if they interrupted uh, that reset, wouldn't all the data be corrupted? Yeah, that's, that's what happened to me. No. That's what happens to me. I'm no, not in, like, super future stuff. Find a way to escape. So I'm pretty sure you can, like, straight up die here if you don't fast enough. Oh, good. See what we can do. Around for... R2. Or for, for right leg. Forward. One. Also short circuit. Oh, I see. Green cable. Mash it. So I just hold, so I just mash, so I just push. Pretty close to dying there. Good job. I think at least. Get up. Stand up. And at four, your robot rights. Mission accomplished. What? You know, just, repaired. just uh you know just revert to a a, a previous version yeah that's right yeah so, 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 soft reset oh help us the unsightly beast has come to eat us to the heck eat is that dark from? soul oh i don't know why i think you'd ever Quote anything, but don't. it's what it reminded me of. It's the <laughs> dude from from. No. This can't the combination of Gale and the, the, the when that one dude in Ludwig's chamber. He likes to play with us, creating monsters. Like Andy. For his amusement. From Toy Story. Oh yeah. But who's the real monster? Andy. No. He did to us. Buzz. What's his name? Kid. Oh yeah, the the the, yeah, the bully. Yeah, Buzz yeah. is the brother Buzz is... from is Buzz Lightyear, but when yeah. I said Buzz, Buzz is the brother in Home Alone. Not Andy. Sid, 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 Sid. All right. So long. Sorry, I haven't seen Toy Story in like f fifteen years. In a while. Yeah, I remember really liking it. I'm sure it's great. Yeah, yeah. Never seen Toy Story three. Isn't it the one with the? Saw the, the first like ten percent with you when we were at the creation yes. conference and we were oh, done tidying yeah. up and they were like getting the cars ready and I was just like, I'm tired. Toy Story three is on. Yeah, they, they were playing Toy it on 3. the big screen. Yeah. We were just kind you of showed that movie's amazing. I want to see it. Just cause Toy Story 4 is a thing. Wait. Ten Minotas remaining. Find Alice. Am I supposed to go... This way. Wait, did he say to go in the kitchen? Uh, Luther said, uh, meet me in the living room. Living room. Wait, Luther went up there, though. Well, Luther's also probably a bad guy. Is he? Well, he was working with... Uh, but why would he Spooko go up to her, up to her and be like... Meet me in the living room. I don't know. Maybe he's double agent. Maybe he's uh, he was just like giving you instructions for when your memory was wiped. It was odd. It does seem odd. That would be the case. Well, I feel like this is a bad idea, but I don't know where else to go. So. I love this time wasting. <laughs> I know that's not there. Okay. I think you're gonna hate this part, honestly. Uh, 
Why, why does it want me to look at the front? I think it's the RE9. Okay, well, I guess I'll go talk to Luther then. You got more stuff up here to, to check. Yeah, yeah, the just game, upstairs in general. The game, game kind of wants me to, to hurry up, though. So, I don't know. The game doesn't it isn't telling you to go talk to Luther. It's Alice. But the game's like... Whoa, cyborg bear. Pretty cool. But... Whoa! Can open it... the cage? Not hate this part then. Depends on what happens, I guess. Dude, that's awesome. Ride the bear, golden compass style. <laughs> what are you doing here? Has the master authorized you to be here? You must always obey the master. Oh yes, you must always obey. What are you doing? Hey, Luther. Been in there. Uh, I didn't like really go in there, but I think that's where the bear is. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. I. I'm sorry. About the little one. He is a good dude. I mean, it's the only thing that made sense. It would be it would make no sense if he was a bad dude. He was just like in the living room. Ha! I tricked you. Even though you he could have been awesome. Even yeah. though you wouldn't remember this. He could have been awesome. After yeah. I told you this. Yeah, but he knew that he would. You wouldn't remember. Yeah, I know. You could have been ocelot. He could have been ocelotting you. Ocelotting, not Kara. You. I care about that? There's a gun. Right there. Where? There's a shotgun. Where? On the side oh, table. Oh. Maybe yeah, we should get that. It's not loaded. Right, fine. Don't bullets. put it down. All right. Here. Well, if you're taking a big leap of faith in in that this game makes sense. <laughs> Public opinion. I, I, I am taking a, a big leap there. Maybe Alice is in this fire. Alice, is that you? <laughs> you're a, you're a burning stick now. What have they done to you? Okay, so we we went through the left door. Yeah, that's the hallway. That's the we, hallway. We haven't checked that room yet. This is the corridor, and then there's one. Yeah, right there. These doors open, real nice, like. He turned my boy into a box. A box! <laughs> my boy's a box! Car, you remember me? Look how they massacred I'll my boy. I forget you. I'm so sorry. 
Either way, we never should have come here. It's every Skyrim bandit. We never should have come here. You should have come here. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Hey, are you the dragonborn in full dragon bone armor? You never should have come here. Never should have come here. Pulls out iron dagger. I'll be the guy to, to get you. Basically, stark naked almost with a with a Luther. axe. Hello. Oops. Yes, Slav. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little. Marge have got bad news. Bart's a I box really now. <laughs> Classic. <All> yeah. Right. <laughs> Totally. Okay. I'm Gotta go to, through the rooms. I'm to go this way. You ready for stealth? Hide or not? Wait, wait, wait. Question mark spots. It's like my wife calls children for? it all the time. What? No, she doesn't. Yeah, does she? she does. Does she? Yeah, with all the, the necklaces, like, give it to me. I'll, I'll hold oh, it. yeah, she yeah. does. Yeah, it's weird. Does. I don't know why. Her whole family uh, does it's that. It's just a tongue in cheek thing, I think. So, am I meant to be holding this button? I think oh, I am. Someone's in the room with you. Yeah, sometimes the game. Like wants me to hold a button, but it doesn't want me to hold the button. So like, I'm holding it because I, I'm a little concerned that. Uh, Coming. Be holding it. I'm just gonna keep holding it. The door shut. I think they're gone. Shotgun's still there. That I can't pick it up though. If I go out, go out this way. I'm gonna control it. Get out of here! Oh oh! Right, I'm running now. All of a sudden. What, what, what? Did we even like, check the back doors even was available? No, but I'll tell you, uh, as a guy who also picked back door and Tristan picked front door, you go to open the front door and it's chained. Alice. Okay. And he goes, uh-oh. Go, Alice. No, I won't leave. Go, run as fast as you can. I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. But she picks up, uh, picks up fire, stares at some logs beside. Then for some reason is like, burn the curtains instead of the, burn the curtains. What are you doing? Yeah, I thought I was gonna pick it up as a weapon, but get out of my Sorry. way. No, not this time. I said get out of my way, or I'll shoot right through you. Oh, okay. How dare you? you. Oh man, it's, sm it's, it's small soldiers. It's small soldiers. Or literally the scene from uh, Toy Story. Get away yeah. from the backyard. Yeah, that's it. Get away from me. Obey me. I'm your master. I'm your master. <laughs> that hit. I'm your master. Ah! <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, well, job's done. 
Um, Time to go continue being monsters. <laughs> hey, that's your skills, right? He's like, he's like, oh, I'm gonna shoot you. No, it's mine now. Mine now. Took that gun away from him so easily. It's so easy. I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you. My programming was broken it was like by the power of love. Yep. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. The Canada. You see. I could take you there. You see, because the robots you. are being oppressed. You and the little one. Wait a second. Oppressed? Canada, America. I don't get it. Maybe, maybe someday I'll, I'll have to think about the the. It's probably because. This. Probably because. It's they want to watch the Toronto Blue Jays play oh, in yeah. the final game. Oh. Toronto. Oh, that, that, bye, Bear. <laughs> bye, Bear. So, I assume if you went to go sneak into the room with I could, the though. bear. I was gonna go into the room, but I couldn't. I think it's because you set fire, so you had to oh, run. Okay, maybe. So. I didn't set the fire. I didn't even know you could do that. Yeah. Luther joins Kara. You didn't have a choice. Nope. Chase started. Bear attacks Zlaco and protects Kara. Bear. Leave hiding spot. Go through bathroom. Sneak through storage room. Continue. Push the pause button. It's time. Hey, we got it's, it's 242. Hours in. Ugh, fine. We got another 15 fine, minutes. Fine. We'll finish this talk with Amanda. Okay. Oh, I, I thought I had I thought I had a cane there. Okay. Not walk over here. Nope. All the path. <laughs> what what is the video game? But what what are video games? Just you just go down the path. I mean the game. I mean yeah though. No. I mean yeah though. In like eighty percent. But of if a game would choose like oh there's a path and then there's some grass. If you're not I gonna use the, the umbrella, grass. why do you have it? It's not for you. Oh. Like I go over here. Oh my gosh! It's amazing! I can go around it instead of just going straight. Freedom. It feels it's delicious. I, I want more. I want no, more you freedom. Don't. You don't. You don't. Maybe, maybe not in this game, but. Hello, Amanda. Kaya, I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? Why doesn't Connor just stop that his programming if it's that easy to do? Case. Connor doesn't want to stop his programming. Mm. Oh, I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Maybe you should consider replacing me. Did you manage to learn anything? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. What else? Well, I know one more thing, and something I missed. I found its diary. Apparently. But it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. You came very close to capturing that deviant. Got information. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this, whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. 
A new case just came in. Find Anderson and Sweet. investigate it. Do more of that. What, you don't want to play more Marcus? Find him his storyline compelling so far, like, all that interesting the painting part was pretty the painting neat, part I was thought. was the the highlight so <laughs> it oh. all goes downhill and oh. then there's one bump of fun little, and then and it goes then back downhill back down no. i feel like i don't know honor and lieutenant's relationship is like so i don't know strangely natural um hank is his name Anderson. Okay, pause now. Because this next whole thing is going to be like an hour. Really? And we, you, you can't go in the in the middle of it. You saw with the, the last scene. We restarted it. Right. So, okay. we'll be back on Tuesday. More of this. More fun, happy... And it's it, we can start the stream on a high note. We start with Connor. Yep. And not with Kara. So <laughs> that'll be fun. Thanks, guys, for joining us. Thanks for hanging out. It was out. fun. Uh, <sighs> Bye. See, we'll see you on... No, not yet. Uh, we'll see you on... Tuesday. Tuesday. Uh, hopefully, we can, you know, not get too busy or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, I don't think there's anything in yeah. keeping us. That's the what, weather again. That's what you're saying? Yeah. Uh, I mean, technically, isn't Connor a deviant if his programming told him to catch the deviants and then stopping... Uh, and then he stops chasing one to save the other guy that doesn't count as, uh, as breaking programming? No, because he's supposed to build a relationship with Hank and he is subs he is he is working for Hank. He is yeah. Hank's partner. And Hank so when, not without, chase him without Hank, there's no investigation and you're not chasing the deviants. You have to keep the police happy is is what's going on. I think on. that's like the like So that's the that's why there's like the program instability cuz you you are given contradictory statements to follow. Catch the deviants but listen to Hank. Right. You are assigned to Hank. Right. Not assigned necessarily to the case. Yeah, so it's, yeah. It's so, cool. well, I mean, you are assigned to the case, but so is hey Hank guys. as a partner. Yeah. So, anyway. I'll, uh, I'll see you when I get back to, back to doing some streaming this weekend. We'll see you based on what's going on. But, you know, I might be free to do some Kingdom Hearts 3 streaming. And, uh, yeah. All right, guys. All right. Talk to you later.